Hello, my sweet babies. How's everyone doing today? All right, today, Godland sent me these to use on my channel. So, they sent me some, um, uh, Lord have mercy, I just went blank. Rubber stamps. But, I got to pick out what I wanted. So, I wanted these trees. Y'all know I love trees. And then I got these flowers. Because you can put, uh, do your resin and then stamp your flower in there. And then put a top coat and it's so pretty. Okay? Then, these die cuts. Now, you have to have a die cut machine. But what do I tell y'all all the time? Honey, just because they say what something is made for, that doesn't mean that's what you got to use it for. Is that right? So, I got these. Y'all look. Look at that. Is that not pretty? I love it. That's gorgeous. So, what I'm thinking about doing, look at this one. Oh, they're beautiful. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Is that not? Oh, look at this one. Oh, so what I'm, my first video is going to be with the, well, I think it's going to be with this cross right here. I'm just going to stencil, I think I'm going to stencil it on to a uh, coaster, I believe. You know, just to see how it works. Now, this one's pretty too. Look at that. Now then, I tried um, using them with my clay, and I'll show you that. Look at this. They're gorgeous. Gorgeous little things. And I got all crosses because I love crosses. Look at that little one. Ain't that pretty? So let me show y'all how it turned out. My little clay things. Now I broke one. I know. God. Broke one of them. Now this is the little one. Let me show you what I, what I did. I just pushed it down in some clay. Now the clay is uh, cured. It's hard. So, you can paint it now. See? I can paint it. Okay? And then, this one is going to be the praying hands. This one right here. See that? Look at that. And it works. It works in clay. And now, all I have to do is paint it. Ain't it pretty? So, I'll show y'all how I used it in dye. I mean, God bless it. In a clay, okay? I'll show you what I did. All right? Now then, this one. Now this one, I don't know if I pushed enough. I don't think I pushed enough. But this is the little bird. This is going to be this one. Now, if you, if you can see it, this has a little lip. Because it's supposed to cut, I think, paper. I'm not sure. For you to make put on cards or something. But... Like I said, I don't have a dye machine, so I use clay. Is that not pretty? I think it's pretty. So, I'll be showing y'all on the next video how I did those, okay? But today, I'm thinking I'm just going to stencil this into a coaster. I think. I think that's what I'm going to do. If I can get that off. That does not want to come off. Let me see if I can push it. Mm. Okay. So, I think we're going to be using this one. Mm-hmm. So, let me get everything together. But I just wanted to show you, and I'll put the links down below for these. Okay. And the, uh, well, I may put the link on the second video for the rubber stamps, since we're going to be doing that. On the second video, this one is just the unpackaging and the how to use it in a different way. Okay, so got that. All right, now then, let's get to the uh, blessing board for June and the prayer board and the shout outs. All right. Miss Brenda Levi, Miss Stacy Snorf, and Miss Brenda Hickerson for June blessing board. 
Shout outs, Cosmic Carol Creations, India Brady Art, Art by Me by Andrew Walker, Naptime Creations, Tanya Beecher Woodturning, T and Art, Rez C. Liz, and my baby Christopher. Hey, darling. Hope you're having a good day today, baby. It's hot, honey, so try to stay as cold as you can. All right, darlings, here we go with the prayer board. Miss Brenda Gaddy, Stacy Snorf and her mama, Miss Rose and her mama, Miss Annette and her mama, Miss Vicky. She's do, uh, having to take physical therapy for her help. So let's pray it's working. Um, Miss Bonnie Davis, I still haven't heard from Miss Bonnie. I'm going to try to see if I can find that email she sent me. Her husband has surgery May 31st. So let's pray everything went well and um, speedy recovery, okay? Miss Robbie Ivy, Levi the Miracle Warrior on Facebook. Miss Brenda Hickerson, they had an EF2 tornado. Oh, Lord of mercy. Let's pray every, they're getting everything back. Like it's supposed to be, okay? Uh, Miss Patricia Davis, she had knee surgery, so let's continue uh, prayers for Miss Patricia, okay? Uh, Miss India, bless her heart, her eye, she went to the doctor and um, they had messed up her appointment, bless her heart, so she's going back Monday, I believe. I believe it's Monday, so let's pray she gets on in there and gets that eye seen to, okay? And Mr. Casey Bowman for his help. All right, darlings. All right, so let me get my stuff together and see what I want to put this cross in. And um, I'll be back, okay? All right, loves. I thought about doing this. Trick or tray, because that fits perfect in there. That's going to be pretty. I think it's going to be pretty. Okay. So, I got my acrylic paint pens. That'll be in the description. I've got my J. Diction resin because I'm going to be doing this first. And I want to go ahead and get that cured so I can pour my top layer and let that cure. And then we'll be putting the cross in there. Okay. I'm going to just put a little bit. And then put my cross in. I think I'm going to do a, just a little bit of clear maybe. And then lay the cross in. Paint it with my paint pens. Take it out. Put another layer of mirror mirror on top of it. That's what I'm thinking now, Lord Jesus. I hope I, hope it works out like it's in my head. So, anyway. Let me, Lord, my God, you got cut. What am I thinking? Let me just get one of these since we're using... Less resin. I mean, uh, J. Diction, Lord. All right. Let's get started. So what I'm going to do, I don't want this big old cup. Lord mercy. Let me get me a little cup. Hold on just a minute. Give me a little one. An little bitty one. Okay. I'm going to put some in here. You know what? I may just put it around the edge. And then put my um, mirror mirror in. Because it's going to sink anyway. So, why not? So, we're just going to go around. This is going to be the first layer. And if you've never used J-Diction UV resin, you are missing out, babies. This is the best. UV resin on the market. I'm telling you, it cures hard. It's not sticky. Alright, now I'm just going to put that up. Okay, might do the whole doggone thing and make sure it's touching my edges. Okay, now then, get me a little spoon. Now, this mirror mirror is from Laura's Art Corner. Ain't that just gorgeous? Ain't that gorgeous? Oh, it's pretty. 
Now, when you get it, you want to give it a little stir around because it has chunky and fine in there. And you want to get a little bit of all of it. Okay? So here we go. Oh, crap. Hope I can do it. I'm going to pull my side out just a little bit. And I'm going to dump me some in there. Then I'm going to take my silicone brush and go around it and make sure it's on all the way around. You don't want to put much. You don't want it opaque because the heat lamp has got to get in there to cure your resin. Cure UV resin, okay? Now then, Father's Day is coming up and... Oh, I'm going to be doing those um, heart molds that was sent to me. I've already got Daddy's picture cut out to go in the picture one. So, that's coming. All right, now, let me get me a silicone brush. And I'm just going to go around the edge like this and just make sure it's all in there this is some gorgeous stuff mm -mm -mm. I see Miss Sherry Moulton using it I said oh I gotta have some of that because she loves it she loves it so and I see why I see why Miss Sherry because it's pretty Alrighty, now we got that. Okay, let me wipe that off. All right, I'm gonna pause y'all and I'm gonna cure it. All right, loves, we're gonna go in with our second coat. I'm just coming up to the edge. Oh, I'm just about out of this good stuff. Okay. All right. I think that's up to the edge. Now, you want to keep your bottle away from your UV light. Okay. be back. I do 60 seconds three times and then I hit it with the 99. Okay? And this lamp is a Sun M1 two-handed nail lamp. That's all it is by Johnson. I've had it I think over a year if not more. So, so far so good. It'll be in the description. Okay? All right, babies, now, I'm going to put a clear, clear, I'm a, and let that cure. Then I'm going to put this on it, because I don't want to wait. I'm just going to take this top off and just pull them some in there, Lord, hit me. That's what I'm going to do, until it covers this part, okay? Shouldn't take my, I hope I got enough. Oh, please, let me have enough. Mm -hmm. I'm using it all. <laughs> Oh, okay. I got a little bit left, I think. All right, I'm going to take my little tool here. I'm going to make sure ain't no little bubbles trapped around these edges here because I don't want any bubbles. See, this way we can go ahead and cure it and put our cross down, okay? All right. Now let me cure this. I'm going to give this a little heat because I see it's just a couple bubbles. Let it get hot. And pop those bubbles. 
Okay. Now then, I'm going to cure it 60 seconds three times and then hit it with a 99. Okay. I'll be back. All right, loves. It's all cured. So now I'm going to lay my cross. Ain't that pretty? I'm going to lay my cross. I got my resin mixed up here and it's getting hot. So I got to hurry. And I'm using um, this Platinum Clear by the Epoxy Resin Store. 30 to 35 minute working time. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to make it. So, let me get a wriggle on here. Now, I'm just going to lay this in here. Like, like that. Okay. Push it down just a little bit. Just a little. Alright, now I'm going to take this black acrylic paint pen. I've got to hurry. And I'm just going to Go off in there, and I hope it works. Because if it don't, I don't know what to do. Oh, God. Come on out. Oh, no. I may have to go ahead and pour my resin in and do the paint next. Because I do not want to lose this resin. Let me get this off. That's what I'm going to have to do, guys. So, let me put me some, some of this in here. That's what I'm going to have to do. Oh, I don't want to, though. I want to do my... Doggone it. I don't know. I don't know. Let me try it again. Where is my black? What did I do with it? Wanda. Shake, shake, shake. All right, I'm going to try. I'm going to try to hurry. Come on out of there, baby. Come on. Come on. It's not coming. No! What's going on? It's not coming out. Oh my god. Okay, I gotta do something different. So, hold on. Oh lord. Oh, oh god. Oh, my resin's hot. Yeah, it's hot. Okay, I'm gonna have to pour it in. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Because if I don't, I'm gonna lose it. I'm going to lose it, babies. Take on it. I can't. <sighs> Hold on. All right, let's see. Let's see if I can hurry. I'm going to try to use my relief pens. Let's see how that works. I don't know. But then I'll have to let it dry, won't I? Okay. One minute. All right, I'm not losing this resin. So, I'm going to put it in this beautiful mold. I'm going to put some of this off up in there. Okay. I'm going to put two big scoopy scoops. Oh, Lordy. Get the lid on. Don't want to waste that. All right, let's give it a little stir around. Oh, it's hot. I bet it flash cures. Oh, please don't. Okay, let's get it in. Get it in. Get it in there, girl. Oh, baby, it's hot. Mm -hmm. Okay, got that. Get on in there. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I got one more. I was sent two of them. So we're going to do both. Okay. Now, let's get it off up in here. Oh, as long as it don't flash cure, everything will be great. All right, get off up in there. Okay. Okay, okay. Alright, now, let me find one more. One more little mold. One more. Um, 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 um. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. I know that ain't big enough. I need a bad one. Alright, I'm just going to pour it in here. I know it's not enough to fill it, but it's okay. It's okay. Oh, Lordy. It's 
don't do it. Don't do it. It's starting to get a little thick. Don't do it. Come on, baby. Come on. Yep, it's starting to set. Oh, my God. It's starting to gel up on me. Get in there. Get in. Ah, there it is. Now, I don't know if it's going to flash here on me. I hope not. Now, I'm going to clean my stick right quick. I'm going to give this a little spready spritz because we don't want any bubbles. Give it a little tappy tap. Give this a little squisher. Get it over there in all the little holes. <laughs> I don't know why I mixed it up so quick. Because I thought the paint pens was going to work on my cross, you see. <sighs> but it did not. So now, another scrimpy spurt. All right. Whew. Thank you. Okay. Clean the stick. Okay. I love this big stick. And this is the only one I have. So I try to keep it clean so I can reuse it. So there we are with that. Okay, now let's move stuff out of my way so I can move this over and get back to my thingy dingy. Come on, baby. Get on over there. Get on over there. Come on. Okay. There that is. Now we'll go put that right there. All right. Woo! Now back to this. That's kind of scary. Let's give it another little. All right, there we are. That's enough of that. I'm getting closed in here. Woo. All right, now then, let's get this going. I'm gonna push it down. Push it down. I wonder. No. All right. Get a paper towel. Now you see what to do if your resin starts curing, honey. Just start throwing out you some molds. All right, let me get this going. All righty. Now I'm going to hold this down. And now I can wait for it to dry, you see. I'm going to go around this edge here with this relief. It's called PBO Relief Outliner Black. Okay. I don't know why my paint pens wouldn't work. They gum it. But they wouldn't. I know they work on regular resin, but it just. I know, it's like it didn't want to come out, but that's okay, honey. We're going to get it. We're going to get it, ain't we? All right. Sure, some up in the corners. And it don't take long for this to dry because it's hot. I got my air on. I got my air purifier going because I had mixed up that resin. So when you're mixing up resin, always wear your mask, darling. And um have a well ventilated area. Okay? Because even though you don't smell it, even though it does not have a smell, it is still letting off fumes. Okay? Always keep that in mind. Alright. I 
hope this works. <laughs> I hope when I pull my cross up, the whole thing don't come up. My relief don't come up with it. Hey, possibility. If it does, I'll just wipe it down and go to something else. on. Check for bubbles over here. I don't see any. Yay. That's over poured, but it's okay. Let me slide a little stick under there. Slide a little stick. Honey, that stuff ain't going nowhere. It's jelly. Oh, God. Alright, now then. I'm going to use some copper. And I'm going to just do the edges of with these little holes with the copper. Okay. Somato girly. Y'all. Me and girly was outside this morning. And um, I was coming in. And a little puppy came up to us. Somebody had done put a little puppy out. And I know exactly who it was. I know who did it. It's a shame. But this person that did it knew that puppy would be taken care of. But I cannot have another. I just can't. I can't have another dog. So, my son is coming to get it. Praise God. Because I just can't, I can't deal with another one. Girly and Cookie are enough. But if he don't come... Poor little thing. It was out there just crying. Probably wanting its poor mama. <clears throat> just makes me hot. Alright, let's see. I want different colors in the middle, so I'm not even going to be messing with that. Um, I think I want some, like, maybe um, right here. Right here in this spot, maybe. <sighs> So, I have to find people to dog sit when I go somewhere now. Oh, Lordy. Okay. Now, I think that's good. I think that's good. I think that's what I want. Now, all right. Got that. Now then, so we've used the copper and the black. Now I have gold, and this says transparent. I don't know if it dry, dries clear. I guess so. So, we'll go in with this um, gold. Okay, here we go. And fill it in. Fill it the rest of the way in. I think I just got some black. Oh, put gold. And the rest of them. Oh, I hope it works. Because it's really going to be pretty. But if it don't, if I pull the cross up and my relief comes up with it, I'll just get me some, um, some of those stamps. Different color stamps. And just stamp it. And pray that works. Now I see a little uh, hole in one of them. That one right there needs some more copper. It's hot, y'all. 
the heat index here is ridiculous. The heat index was 110 yesterday, guys. Oh, it was so hot. Just muggy hot. I think my cousin has found somebody to um, come get her car and put a transmission in it. So that's a blessing. But yeah, there's some black in there. So let me get something to get that out. Oh, let's see. Maybe this. I don't know if that'll work. There's just a little piece right there. Come on, baby. Don't do it hard because it will scratch your mold, okay? All right, now, got it out. And I gotta put a little copper in that other hole over there. Hey, if it, um, if it don't work, I may just leave the whole die cut in there. You know? <laughs> oh! <laughs> I don't think I mi missed anything. All right. Now let's get this little hole on this copper field. And I'll let it dry. And when it dries, I'll be back. Okay. And it's not going to take long. Look at there. There's a hole. It will not take long. All right. I don't think there's... It's already starting to dry. Yay! We're gonna flip it over and see what it looks like on the other side. We'll do a little cheat just to see what it looks like. Mmm, the copper's pretty. All right, let's see if I can flip it without the cross falling out. Let me see if I can. Hold it right here. Well, you can see it a little bit. I think it's going to be pretty. All right, babies. I'll be back when it dries, okay? All right. All right, loves. Now, I'm thinking, since I don't have a die cutter, I'm thinking I'm going to leave this in here. Because... I will get this silver outline. You see what I'm saying? It's dry. Oh, I don't know what to do. You're not going to see this side, you see. You're going to see the other side. Okay, I'm going to leave it. I'm leaving it in there. I'm going to leave it. Let's just see if it'll pop up. Let's try that and see if it'll... See if the um, color will stay down there. Uh, yeah, I think it is. Well, no. In some spots it's not. So I'm going to give it a push. So I'm leaving it in. Leaving it in, babies. Oh, Lordy. All right, I mixed up me some more rest. The same kind. Uh, what did I say it was? Premium Clear by the Epoxy Resin Store. It has, let's see, uh, 30 to 45 minute working time. Okay. 35. That's what I'm thinking. Because my video is only 34 minutes long. I don't even know if it, hey, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's according to how deep it's in your cup. Maybe if I would have put it in separate cups, maybe it wouldn't have uh, went off so fast. Alright, we'll give this a little blow. Get the bubbles off. Okay. Now then, we'll let them come to the top again. 
and then I'm going to add some black diamond silver pearl because I want it white. I want that silver and gold and copper and black to pop. So, hope it the resin not, it won't go under there. Ah, I'm trying to push it down in there. Real good. Okay. And then I'm going to add some of this, of course. Oh, Lordy. Okay. A spoon. I think it's good. Yeah. I'll blow it once I get it in there. I hope this comes out. Let me get my little Wanda. Get your stuff together, girl. All right, here we go. We'll put two scoops. One, two. Again, this is Mirror Mirror, Laura's Art Corner. Okay. All right, now let's get a little bit of this. Black Diamond. Mm. Silver Pearl. I figured they'd be pretty since this is silver. So I'm going to put maybe one scoop of that. So what it looks like. And then, and then if I want some more, I can put some more. Okay. All right, let's give it a little stir around, see what we got. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Can you see it? Look. It's sparkly. It's sparkly. Give it a good mix because you don't want your mica floating to the top. Which this is going to be the back, so it really don't matter, but I still don't want it to float. Alright, babies. Let's get it in. Get it in there. Here we go. I hope I mix up enough. Just gonna pour it in. Oh. Mm -hmm. There we are. Holy moly. There we are. I forgot my cousin was leaning on my table. And it's not level anymore, and I forgot to level it, so I'm gonna have to stick. Put some sticks under here. Make it level again. Okay, maybe one more on this end. Wow. I have got to level it back. There we go. Maybe that's it. I think that's it. And I think this stick is warped. Yep. Oh! Oh, that's it. Yay. So it's just this end. Alright. Let's pour the rest. And then I'm going to give it a blow. Okay. Give it some heat. And I'll let it set. And we'll come back when it's uh, cured. And we'll see what that uh, dye but looks like. Honey, when I seen those crosses and praying hands, I was like, oh yeah. Yes, that's what I want. Knowing I didn't have a die cutting machine, but you know I always find a use for it. So, don't have to have one. Alright, love. I'm going to pass out if my die cut starts floating to the top. <laughs> All right. I'm going to cover this up. And when it cures, babies, I'll be back. Okay? All right, babies. It's ready. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, I hope it's pretty. I can get it. 
I'm done. Oh, I'm nervous, kinda. <laughs> you can see it a little bit. I'm nervous. A little bit nervous. It's still a little sticky, like on the edge, but we can demold it. All right, y'all ready? Oh, God. I bet a, a die cut has never been put in resin, has it? Oh, Lord of G. Well, here it is. Oh, yes. That's pretty. I like it. And you can see the silver. I'm glad I left that in there. I am glad. And look at that mirror, mirror, y'all. If y'all like it, give it a thumbs up. I think it's pretty. The camera will focus. Y'all like it? Mm -hmm. I think it's really pretty. I may do another one because um, you know I got a bunch. And uh, do different colors like pink and yellow and purple. And that'd be pretty, wouldn't it? All right. These are ready. Honey, these are... Uh, Went on ahead and cured. I hope, just hope it didn't mess up my mold. I don't think it did. I don't think it did. Mm -mm. And it's hard as a rock. Hey. Nope. Didn't mess up my mold. Yay. Now here it is. The, this is a cherub on a leaf. Hope y'all can see it. See her? Here she is. There's her face. Look at that. Y'all, I had to hurry up and pour it in there. Now, what I'm going to do is probably hit it with some gold accents or something. You know, go around the edge with some gold or something. I don't know. I don't know what to do to her. I might take my... Let's just see. Let's just see. We got two of them. So, let's take this one out. I put a little bit of that white uh, that I had left over. From this on this one but it didn't I say it didn't make any difference did it so there's the other one oh no oh, look at it just precious I love them let's see now the green I mean uh, acrylic is supposed to paint on resin resin now it would not do it on the UV I don't know why it wouldn't come out. Maybe the hole wasn't big enough where I was trying to put it. I don't know, because usually it it um, does it on all of it. Let me get me a little paper towel, and we're just going to see. We're going to see what's going on. Come on here. Okay, here we go. Prime it up. All right. Let's get this one. And let me see. Now, see there. Look at that. It does good on... Um, Regular resin. That's crazy. Look at that. Ain't that something? Mm hmm. Look at that. Not pulling apart or nothing. Look at it. Come on. See? Staying right where I put it. So we can paint the leaf. Wow. And paint the cherub. So I'm going to do that. And uh, I'll see y'all on the next video. Hey, let me try something. Let me try something. Since this, uh, I want to try this again. Because I don't understand. It usually works on UV resin. I'm just going to like. Go around the edge. I might should use silver since the cross is silver. Oh, did but gee. Let me get a silver. Alright. Oh, I've never used the silver. Wow. Come on out of there, baby. Come on. Here it comes. Okay. There we go. Now, let's just see. I will be doggone. Look at it. I think it was just the, um, I think it was just the, 
the hole wasn't big enough to get my paint down in on that cross because it's just a painting away on this edge here. Painting away, babies. Look at it. Hmm. I knew it was supposed to. Shoot far. I think that's something. I'm going to go around in here. Get this little edge. Silver acrylic. Paint pen. Come on. Oh, oh, I'm starting to make a mess. Alright, there we are. There it is. Mm -mm -mm. Let me show you now. See there? Just painted it right on up. Look at that. So there it is, babies. There you go. I love y'all. And thank y'all for watching. And uh, I'll see y'all. On the next video, and I, it's probably going to be the rubber stamps next since I used one of these. I'm going to probably do the rubber stamps next, okay? All right, darlings. Peace, love, prayers, and happiness, babies. Bye. Sweet babies. Family prayer cards again. <sighs> Guess what? They was right here. I tore this room up, and I knew... I, the last time I said I'm going to lay them right here, well, yeah, they was laying there. Of course they was. So, let's get us one out. Oh, that one wanted to jump out, so let's just do this. All right. In him was life, and that life was the light of all mankind. In him was life, and that life was the light of all mankind. John chapter 1 verse 4. Amen. Ain't that right, babies? All right, darlings. This video probably will not upload until tomorrow because y'all know my Wi-Fi, honey, is just crap. I'll be glad when they get through with this um, this uh, fast Wi-Fi they done put out here in these boondocks. So I can get that, and maybe it'll be better. All right, babies. I love y'all.